Hi, good morning. Today we are going to learn distance formula. Given the two points x sub 1, y sub 1, and x sub 2, y sub 2, the distance between these points is given by the formula d equals the square root of, we have x sub 2 minus x sub 1 squared plus y sub 2 minus y sub 1 squared. Yeah. So again, this is called the distance formula. And it's not. Notice that this distance formula is a variation of the Pythagorean theorem. Okay, review nothing. Yung Pythagorean theorem is, if you have remembered, we have c squared equals a squared plus b squared. Diba? So we have this as um, this one. Kasi d squared yan, kung wala itong square root. Okay? And a squared, we have this. And b squared is this one. Right? So again, this is called the distance formula. So, uh, we use the distance formula in finding the distance between two points in um, the Cartesian plane or in the xy plane. Right? Find the distance between two points whose coordinates are 3, negative 2, and negative 2, 10. So, example number 1. We have the points 3, negative 2, and negative 2, 10. Right. So 3, negative 2, we consider this as our first point. Negative 2, 10, we consider this as our second point. Okay. So U3, uh, we will consider this as x sub 1, and this will be x sub 2. In negative 2, we consider this as our y sub 1, and y sub 1 and 10 would be our y sub 2. Alright, because this is our first point or p, so this is our p sub 1, and this is our p sub 2. Okay, first point, and we have the second point. Alright, so we have this distance formula. Sulat natin yung distance formula. So again, you have to memorize the distance formula. The distance formula is d equals the square root of, palagi mauna yung x sub 2. Okay? So x sub 2, yan ang minusan natin ng x sub 1. Tapos, do not forget to square it. Then it's always plus. Then yung y sub 2 minus y sub 1, and then you square it. So, we have the square root of um, direct substitution. We have our x sub 2. x sub 2 is negative 2. So, we have negative 2 minus x sub 1 is 3. Okay, minus 3 squared plus y sub 2 is 10. All right. 10 minus our y sub 1 is negative 2. So, minus negative 2 squared. So, don't forget that square root. Okay? So, simplifying, we have negative 2 minus 3. That is negative 2 minus 3. That would be negative 5 squared. Importante dito yung um, addition and subtraction of integers, ha? Yung mga signs, be careful with the signs. If we have two negatives, negative, negative, then we add and copy the common sign just like negative 2, just like this. Negative, negative yan. So, negative 2 minus 3, that's negative 5. I-add, tapos copy the common sign. Right? And, um, kung... Positive, negative, that's minus, and copy the sign of the greater number. It's plus, and then we have 10 minus negative 2. Ito naman, negative, negative, negative times negative, that becomes positive, ha? Huh? Okay? That becomes positive. So, magiging 10 plus 2. So, this becomes 10, negative, negative, plus 2. So, that becomes 12. Okay, 12 squared. 
And so that is equal to right negative five squared. Um, what na lang siya? Isulat ko siya dito. Okay. Okay. D equals walang space. Negative negative five squared five negative five times negative five. So that's twenty five plus twelve squared is one hundred forty four. And then you add 25 and 144. That becomes 100, 169. Okay, 100, square root of 169 is 13. I'm to say the distance between these, these points is 13. We are going to graph that. 3, negative 2. We have 3... Negative 2, I, I, I hope you still know how to graph. And we have negative 2, 10. Negative 2, 10. Kung i-connect natin yan. Um, okay. So this is now the graph. Okay. So we now have this point. Okay, then this is... Uh, negative 2, 10, and this is um, 3, negative 2. So, yung distance formula, ibig sabihin yan, ang um, distance, this point right here, galing dito sa 10, hanggang dito, right? This length, that distance is equal to 13 units. Okay? The distance is equal to 13 units. If it's cm, cm, meter, meter, and so on. Alright, so try find the distance between 2, negative 4, and negative 3, 8.